now our modern society has a weight problem and if you watch TV, the solution is Nutrisystems, Jenny Craig or Weight Watchers. Our next honoree found the best way to lose weight was in the pool. Let's find out more about him. We hope. We hope. <laughs> has been a swimmer his whole life and competed in three individual events for his native country, Brazil, at the 1980 Summer Olympics in Moscow. While he didn't final in any of them, he did swim the second leg on the bronze medal winning 4x200 freestyle relay team, Brazil's only swimming medal at the 1980 Olympics. Mattioli retired from competitive swimming in 1988, but transitioned quickly to master swimming. At the 1988 FINA Masters World Swimming Championships in Brisbane, he set six Masters World Records. After that meet, Marcus stopped swimming and exercising and put on 70 pounds. When he came back to swimming in 2004, it was with the idea to lose that extra bulk and to regain a healthier lifestyle. In the process, he not only regained his shape, but his form as one of the best Masters swimmers in the world. At the 2006 FINA Masters World Championships in Palo Alto, Mattioli set two new Masters World Records, winning two gold and two silver medals. Since his return, Mattioli has been on the top 10 list every year for a total of 15 times. He was recognized by Swimming World Magazine as being one of the 12 best Masters swimmers of 2011. He has accumulated 29 gold medals at the FINA Masters World Championships and four silver medals since 1988 and has set 14 long course and six short course FINA Masters World Records in the freestyle, butterfly and IM. At the age of 57, Mattioli is as active as ever. He is one of Brazil's most celebrated master swimmers, becoming just the second athlete from the country to be inducted into the International Masters Swimming Hall of Fame. He still swims daily, and he teaches at the Caio Marcio Aquatic Center, and also runs his Villa Mattioli Leisure Center. Marcus Mattioli, Honor Master Swimmer, Brazil. Hi there. I hope you. How are you? I hope you're fine. Uh, I guarantee it would be a lot easier to me to get it in the pool and try to set a new world record than be here and stand up in front of you. I don't remember when was the last time I got so nervous. Well, due to my poor English, it can be very hard to me to put in words how glad and how honored and proud am I to be here tonight and be one of the eight swimmers that can be honored by you tonight. So thank you very much for that. And I also would like to say that I'm more prouder and more honored to be part of a very select group of persons. Persons that, are, that they have their body and mind scooped every single day by water most clean water. And even though this water makes their mind, their spirit, and they will and their their will is stronger than still, the same water makes their souls and hearts kind, gentle and soft as clouds. And thank you God for being part of this select group and be and be able to call myself a singer. I would like to end and uh, saying that I've gained a lot of trophies and medals, as I say, during my career. And most of them I forgot, left behind inside some uh, closed door. And none of them, not even the most important one to me, my Olympic medals that I gained in, that I gained in 1980 Olympic Games, I carried on with me. But you guys, every day, Every single moment, I carry you on my right side, on my chest. Thank you, God. Thank you, and may God bless you all, swimmers. <laughs>